Today is World Day Against Trafficking. IOM has been engaged in the fight against trafficking for two decades now. We are encouraged by the tremendous progress that has been made in that time. The widespread criminalization of the crime of trafficking in persons. The innovative use of data to design more intelligent anti-trafficking responses and the thousands of trafficked boys, girls, men and women that have received care and support due to the dedicated efforts of caseworkers and service providers from around the globe. We are also encouraged by the adoption of the Global Compact on Migration, which calls for measures to prevent, combat and eradicate trafficking persons in the context of international migration and to address and reduce vulnerabilities in migration. However, despite these achievements, much remains to be done. Traffickers take advantage of migrants' hopes and dreams, as well as of their vulnerabilities for their own ends. It is true that the drivers of unsafe migration are multiple and complex. Responding to these challenges will require significant investment and international cooperation. But we cannot ignore these challenges whilst at the same time hoping that the unsafe migration and migrant trafficking that falls from them will disappear. Protecting vulnerable migrants is no an uneasy task. It can be hard to identify those who need assistance. It can be difficult to find enough resources to provide the services they need, especially when there are cultural and language barriers, as well as distrust is high. But the situation cannot remain as it is. The loss of life and human suffering is intolerable. I believe that the time for action is now, and I believe that there is a role for everyone to play.